Hi, this is just a small video to show how Stack helps to hack on some random uh, GitHub project. So I picked Twitter Conduit and just checked it out. It's a normal Haskell project, which is a Kabel file. And you can see what's inside. There are various constraints of different sets of library. So in order to use Stack, um, you Stack needs to find which version of, of, of Stackage, which snapshot, uh, to use and in order to do that you use stack init which will read the command file and try various uh, sets so here you can see they checked against 3.3, 2.22 etc etc and actually in the end it didn't find any as you can see so uh, also by the way you downloaded the ones on demand so in the end you gotta pick one and I, I chose um, I chose ninthly, two of September, second of September, and you have to uh, find the complete the project. And in order to do that, uh, to find the dependencies to make it happy, and in order to do that, the uh, stack has a solver. So I simply used it, saying you know stack solver, no system JCs to to force uh, stack to use its own um, version of JC and not my system Y JC. So it found that I needed to add those flags and those extra dependencies. And since we, so those are a uh, hackage package, and but there are various kind of other dependencies you can have. Um, for instance, for GitHub project and or pro project on your file system. Um, uh, but so there's an option to add it uh, to add those dependencies, as you can see, minus dash dash modify stack yaml so it's going to update our stack.yaml file and with that we can proceed to build and uh, there's no problem it has all the dependencies it's building and if we if we look at uh, the 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 project that, that are contained the targets that are in the cabal file one of then it's called oauth underscore pin and here it tells me no I can't recognize it I didn't find it so if you look precisely at the file file we can see that that's a conditional compilation it's you know it depends on the presence of a flag at the cabal level so that's no problem for stack you can give it uh, flags so if you see here is there's a minus minus flag and then the package um, with the flag that you want to set in our case build sample and still no system GSG as you can see it proceeds to compile uh, if you're using ZSH uh, by the way there are some auto completion which are quite handy so as you can see there are many so I would recommend you using ZSH obviously unless you have a fantastic memory um, and once it's done we can just launch uh, our binary and where it runs it didn't find in the environment some variable that's, that's part of the project so I hope this was helpful for some people and uh, thanks to Stack you can uh, enjoy hacking Haskell in a very very lean way so thank for all the stack authors and the stackage maintainers that's just fantastic um, I am eager to see what's going what's coming next in the Haskell developer ecosystem uh, thanks for watching